Do you have to go all the way to Hokkaido just to get good Hokkaido ramen? Well, I don't feel like going to Hokkaido today, so I'm just gonna go to Sharambe in Kobe. I like the way this place sounds. Sharambe. It reminds me of a special someone, and now I'm sad. I promise I'm not gonna give out any extra points for this incredible Dragon Ball and Kamen Rider collection, but I am titillated. Now I've been to Hokkaido, and I've eaten miso butter ramen there, but I ain't never seen no queen in her darn dundies, as the fella says. But sometimes there's a man. Sometimes there's a man. I lost my train of thought here. This looks as Hokkaido-y as you can get. So far, so good. With just one sip, I was instantly transported to Hokkaido. I could feel the cold wind brushing my cheeks. I could smell the starch-laced air of ramen alley. The chewy alkaline noodles. The flavor of the broth. It's ticking every box. This was incredibly delicious, but how could it not be? It's super strong miso flavor, but with butter on top. It was born to be great. I had to get some fried rice as well, because at this point, it's just expected. The color honestly scared me. It looked like it would taste like nothing but egg. But luckily, it was just as good as the ramen. So I guess while our instinct is to gatekeep regional foods, we should all just come together and unite against New York barbecue.